Hello. Out the way. Now, lesson two. In the story, you will have noticed that on each page, there are two descriptions of the dinosaur using adjectives. And those two descriptions are, if you think back to our lesson we did on synonyms and antonyms, those two descriptions are opposites of one another. We've got dinosaur short or very, very long. We've got dinosaur weak or dinosaur strong. So those adjectives describe the dinosaur. They're talking about the characteristics of a dinosaur. Now, today's activity, I would like you to come up with five new pages for the book. Five new pages for the book. There's ten pages in the book normally. I'd like you to come up with five new pages that describe dinosaurs in a way which are opposites to one another. Now, what you could do if you're not too sure about uh, the characteristics to describe of the animal. So think about what we've got in here. We've got weak, strong, short, long. We've got fat, tiny, clean, slimy, spiky, lumpy, sweet, grumpy, dinosaur fast, dinosaur slow. Now, what you could do, if you're finding it a little bit tricky to think of five new ways to describe those dinosaurs, is you could take some of those words and you could think of synonyms for them. So instead of fast or slow, you could think of words with a similar meaning. So what we'd like you to do is to come up with five new pages for the story. Dinosaur something, dinosaur something. But those somethings, those adjectives, should be opposite to one another. Now, if you want to, you can illustrate those pages as well to go with it. Have a listen back to the story if it helps you, if you want to get an idea of what's already been and come up with your own pages to go with this book. Off you go.